For over a century, elephants have been the star attraction at the Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey circuses, but now those animals are being cut from the act. Ringling Brothers announced it will stop using elephants by 2018, saying the decision was motivated in part by public concern about how the animals are treated. Feld Entertainment, Ringling's parent company, has been fighting legislation for years that would restrict how its exotic animals are handled in captivity and during live performances. Some cities, such as Oakland and Los Angeles, passed bans on bull hooks, which are fire poker-like prods used to train and control elephants. It's a weapon that is used each and every time a circus trainer works with an elephant in order to compel strict obedience. The 13 elephants currently on tour with the circus will eventually be retired to Ringling Center for Elephant Conservation in Florida. Approximately 40 Asian elephants are already held there, the largest herd in North America. Public backlash against harsh animal treatment has also affected another entertainment company, SeaWorld. For the first time, SeaWorld is admitting the 2013 documentary Blackfish and the boycotts have hurt its business. The theme park's attendance dramatically dropped after the release of that documentary, portraying its treatment of orca whales as cruel. But Ringling's move may not be all about animal conservation. Fighting legislation restricting elephant use in performances was likely costing the company a pretty penny, so this might just be Ringling throwing in a towel. Animal rights group PETA, a harsh critic of the company for decades, says if the circus were serious about protecting elephants, it wouldn't wait another three years to stop shows. This doesn't mean that Ringling will never use animals again. It will still feature camels, tigers, lions, dogs, and horses. For Newsy, I'm Jasmine Bailey.